everyone, Oldish22 here. I'm back, I'm back, I'm back, I'm back with another My Thoughts video. Um, so yeah, My Thoughts again. I did uh, Goblin Slayer uh, episode 2. And this one's going to be episode 3. So yeah, I want to talk about episode 3 like I did episode 2. I don't know why I keep talking about this, but I do. Um, so anyways, for episode 3 of Goblin Slayer... Um, just in case you guys didn't know, I'm going to be doing spoilers, alright? So if you have not watched this, you're going to have to go away. And if you want to come back and see what I say about episode 3, then come back. So, spoiler warning. Do not watch this video anymore. Spoilers. Alright. So anyways, episode 3 of Goblin Slayer. I'm going to say this right now. It is getting better. From episode 2 was good. And episode 3 has been really cool. The thing about that was really cool about episode 3 is, to me, the world started opening up more. Um, we're starting to learn about, like, dragons and this demon army that's getting summoned. Or While well, the demon lord came back and he's getting an army and he wants to go destroy the world or conquer the world. Because um, the reason why we get this... I uh, oh, apologize, that's my phone. Um... <laughs> So the reason why uh, we learned about this is because he gets a meeting between an elf, which elves are fucking awesome, all right? That's my favorite race of any fantasy um, film. Um, we get the dwarf, which is really cool, too. And then we get a lizard man, which is, it's good. what is this, Skyrim or something? Is this ESO? No, I'm just kidding. But, uh, <laughs> so we get the lizard man guy as well. They all meet, they all want to meet, uh. Goblin Slayer, just because they got a mission or whatever for him. And the funny thing is that I, the thing that I liked about it is when they went to go meet uh, the Goblin Slayer, they were talking about, oh, we got this demon, you know, we got this demon lord that's coming up, and he's gra he's gathering an army, and he's gonna destroy. He wants to conquer this world, and and he's like, he's pretty much like, so what? I don't care. And they're like, what? We're like we all have to fight? No, I don't. I don't give a shit. And they're like, well, there's a there's a huge goblin army coming or yeah. Yeah. They're building a goblin army as well. And he's like, okay, now nah, I'm in, I'll take a, I'll take care of that goblin problem for you. <laughs> so it's like anything with goblins. He's, he's totally in. So I, I did like that. That he's like, I don't give a shit that this demon, whatever Lord is raising an army and that. So, um, I thought that was really cool. Um, another thing I like, I do like, I feel like the night elf, I don't know why I call her night elf, the elf, uh, chick, in this uh, episode, I th I think in this series, she's probably going to be my favorite. Pretty much anyone with a bow, I'm like a huge fan of. All right. I'm just, it's just like, I don't know. I just like, I like bow characters. Like when I play video games, I like bow characters. So <laughs> that's just me. I don't know. So she's probably going to be my favorite character. I like her personality and stuff. That was funny when she was drinking in that. And yeah, a little comedy relief in during the episode too. Um, we didn't get too, too much action. We got to see a little bit of what she can do. Uh, you know, she shot the, at the end of the episode. She shot that arrow. And it, I don't know. She controls it. So she just shot away off and it comes back. And it goes through both two goblins' uh, heads. Um, let's see. We know that they're attacking a cave. We don't know what. This is at the very end of the episode. Um, so I'm really excited to see how the whole group and see what they all do. I'm really curious to see what they do there. So, um. But yeah, I mean, for for most of the episode, like I said, I really like the world building on it. Um, it's it's opening up. I'm really curious. The big thing for me right now that I'm wondering through the series right now is is Goblin Slayer going to come across a demon or something else that's not a goblin, and he's actually going to have to fight it? Because I think that'd be sweet if he actually fights it. But knowing his character, he wouldn't. But then, uh, if, I mean, if it's a self defense thing, he's going to have to. So I'm kind of curious if we're going to get that moment. That it probably won't be till later on. Um, I'm also curious uh, to see, um, like uh, more ranks of goblins. I'm really curious. I'm, I'm curious if there's like a goblin king that he wants to go over and kill. Um, I don't think it really matters to him because it feels. I feel like he just wants to end the race completely. Weird fact. Another thing that I didn't talk about in this that. that they talked about where goblins came from. They said from, uh, he thinks from the moon. Um, I mean, there was like rumors that, uh, but bad children become goblins. 
Um, but then he said something that his sister, let me try to remember correctly. I watched it two, ga two days ago. Um, that his sister said that they came from the moon and because what it was a dry, yeah, it was a dry planet and stuff. So they came to earth or I don't know if it's earth, but whatever their planet, uh, to live there. To, so I don't know. I, that'd be very interesting. Well, there's two moons, so I don't know. So overall there's, there's, so there's a few things I'm really curious that I want to see. And I'm really, this, I'm really excited to see this next battle in this, uh, big K place where they're all going to work as a team in a way. So I'm curious to see how all that, how they work as a team and stuff like that. So, and seeing what the elf lady can do more and the dwarf guy, I feel like the lizard man guy might be a mage. Maybe. I don't know. There was the dwarf guy a mage. I don't think the dwarf guy's a mage. No. No, I think the lizard man's a mage. But anyways, this is my thoughts on episode three. So I hope you guys enjoyed this short video of just my thoughts in episode three. I think I got everything that I can remember. Um, like I said, I, I don't do any script or anything. I just go. That's why I call it my thoughts. I just go off of what's what's in this freaking head of mine. <laughs> but anyways, uh, you guys are awesome. Thank you. Um, if you guys would not mind. God, I can't talk. Um, just hit that red subscribe button down below. That'd be cool. I'm going to keep bringing you some more uh, anime videos, video and videos, and maybe even movie videos eventually. I just don't really watch that many movies anymore. I watch a lot of anime. I like anime. I do. I play a lot of video games. So those are like my two mains. Um, but anyways, yeah, if you guys want, if you guys also want to follow me on Twitter, Instagram, I'm at oldish22. Well, except for Twitter, I'm at oldish with three twos. Um, that'll be down below in the description. But anyways, I truly want to know what your guys' thoughts on episode three or just how the whole series so far is uh, folding up to be. We're three episodes in. I think it's a good series right now. It's not as dark as that first episode, I'll tell you that. <laughs> but I really do enjoy it. So I'm really curious to see uh, what happens uh, next. So I uh, wonder what you guys think. All right, I'm Oldish22. Have a nice Monday night or whatever you are. <laughs> Have a good one, though, guys. All right. See you guys later next time.